Mune chino chirongwa tino tarisikazwa kanangana zvikuru sei nemwea. Nasu uno yu tichange tirikuno kumakomo makuru mpaka tipe harari the Borodel Brook. Chinangwa tirikuda uzukurukura zidu na wamlea the church Kingdom Light Global Kingdom Church. Kingdom Light Global Church. Asika chikonze rochiko wanu wachizutsa nangura zvinhu zvemwea. Kana iyo nyika payaka sikwa chakatanga mwea. Izgui richitaura kuti iwepo. Iye munu wo, achizonzi, unofanira kuwapo uchenge teze jese randaisa pano pasi ne musiki. Nekuda kwe izi, tinotari isa zunuetika kuchivanu, kumachechi, nizume jese shakati tindiriza kuti tiuone mafambiro anueta mwea. Tino kugashira izikuru, mchiro ngwachino, pastor mlea. Thank you very much. <laughs> Tino kudakuti, ti tseketuze, mundi maino the spiritual highway, tichitari sa the healing process. Mm -hmm. Kuti, um, ma, itiro aita jesu, mm -hmm. apu aifamba, on his way to Jerusalem. Mm -hmm. Aisangana nesu wakawanda. Mm -hmm. Mabasi riro ne maitiro, aita, ndiwo enyueri, Ndo ewa mwereka na kuti kwete. Mm -hmm. Ne kuti tino muona isusu eh, Jesus one day mm -hmm. when he entered a city known as Capernaum. Mm -hmm. There was a centurion mm -hmm. who had his slave whom he loved most. Mm -hmm. But he was very sick and at the point of death. Mm -hmm. Upon seeing Jesus, mm -hmm. he said to him, mm -hmm. Do not trouble yourself coming under my roof. Mm -hmm. But just say a word from where you are yes. and let my servant be healed. Exactly. Even though I am a man set mm -hmm. under authority mm -hmm. with the soldiers under me, mm -hmm. and I say to one, go, go and he goes, goes uh, and to another, come and, and he comes, uh, and to my slave, do, do this, this and he does it. Uh -huh. Jesus, I can't pin you that. Ne kuda kwe faith yako. Muno wako nga hiliwe. Sinoti rati za kuti. Muno ano rarama haka tindiri zwa. Nishoko gurure kuti faith. Exactly. Imi muno rapa say. I like how you caught the scriptures. Because every healing and every deliverance, if it is genuine, if it is God who is doing it, it has to be preceded by the teaching of the word of God. The word of God has to come first to the person who is sick or to the person who needs deliverance. And it is the word that has the power to heal and to deliver. I mean healing and deliverance from God. If, you, if, we, if we look at the scriptures in, the, in the Matthew chapter number 8, Matthew chapter number 8. I want to show you how it comes. Matthew 8, and we read from, um, from verse 16. Mm -hmm. He says, When the evening was come, they brought unto him many that were oppressed with devils. Eh? And he cast out the spirit with his word. And healed all that were sick. He cast out the spirit with his word. And healed all that were sick. All. That it might be fulfilled which was spoken by Isaiah the prophet. Saying he himself took our infirmities. And bare our sicknesses. Mm -hmm. Right. Elucidation of the matter. Thank you. <clears throat> we, we can see from uh, the scriptures that. Uh, uh, many people are now confused. They don't know what to believe because everybody seems to be having the power to heal, the power to deliver and all that. But there is the power from God. And this is how you can uh, tell that this is God at work or this person might be using every other power that might be in the in the world. I, I, the reason why I say so mm. is that... Artificially acquired power. Yes. That's what you are talking about. Exactly. Uh -huh. the, the reason why I say so, there are people who do that. For example, when Moses uh, went to Egypt to deliver the children of Israel from, uh, from, from Egypt, mm. he had the rod that uh, he had in his hand mm. and, uh, and uh, 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 God 
said to him, throw down that rod. And he turned into a serpent. So when he got there, and, and after that, God said that this will be, and then he said, pick it by the tail. He picked it by the tail and it became a rod. Showing the miracle power of God. So when he got there and he wanted to deliver them from Egypt, he, he, there were sorceries, ngangas, and all these people who were gathered around the, the king who would do magic. So when he got there and they said, I've come to deliver the people of Israel from bondage. And they, they said, who are you? And they were questioning his power and all that. And then Moses threw out the, the rod on the ground and the rod turned into a serpent. And the magicians who were in that, who were around the king, they also threw their rods on the ground and they turned into a serpent. But the rod of Moses swallowed up all the, 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 the serpents. Those rods were swallowed to show that the genuine power is from Moses. But somebody had also performed the same miracle that Moses performed. So right now I know that people may be confused. So where, who is the genuine God? Because there are a lot of serpents. They are, exactly. And the people are doing the same thing. I can, you can come here, I lay hands on you, you get healed. You go to somebody who is not even worshipping God, they do the same thing. So what, what, how can we know that this is true from God or it's uh, from every other power? Sure. As right. the people, we know not yes. our left from yes. our right. Yes. We so, are in a confused state. Yes. Like a, a, a cockroach in a bag of gamato. Exactly. We don't know what to do. Now, we have three minutes to die. Now, this is this, uh, the reason. The nation. Anybody who heals and delivers through every other means other than the name of Jesus Christ and the word of God that person is not doing it from God. He's just like a magician. This is why you see, this is why you see, the, uh, 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 he said that he spoke his word and cast out devils and healed them mm -hmm. by the word. And uh, this is, the, this is the, 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 the measuring line this is, this, this is where you can tell. This person is using the scriptures. This person is using the name of Jesus Christ to do his work. Not that is the yardstick. Thing. That's the yardstick, yes. Now, uh, what about the anointment oil, the stones, the handkerchiefs, the red clothes that we are, we are seeing people using? All right, all right, all right. The anointing oil, mm. uh, we find it in the scripture. The handkerchiefs, we find them in the scripture. And that was God speaking to a, the prophet mm -hmm. and saying, or the apostle Paul, mm -hmm. and the, then because of uh, the need there. It's, it's not supposed to be taken as a doctrine of uh, healing through, through uh, 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 the handkerchief handkerchiefs or, or, or what. Yeah. It, it, it happened at that time when the Spirit of God uh, ministered to Paul and say, because you cannot be everywhere at the same time, and then, he, and then he, he, he allowed him to use those clothes which had rubbed on his body, and, 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 and the, the anointing was transferred to the handkerchiefs from his body, and then it was taken to those who were sick, and they, they got healed. The problem then, becomes when you do that and you don't explain it to people mm -hmm. that this is what God has said for me to do for now but it doesn't have to be a God that you worship you take it as a God could if if ever you have got a problem instead of praying mm -hmm. you rush to, to the to the handkerchief it was used for that moment don't you bring in the question of faith uh, pastor yes because here we are saying there was a woman mm -hmm. When he saw Jesus, because he was bleeding for too long a time, mm -hmm. he alone had mm -hmm. that problem. Mm -hmm. Not everybody else. Yes. Nukuti, muna ane dambu ziku andiri. Ndiya anu isa dambu ziku raki. Achinko no bata. Yes. Jesus said, who was it that, that touched me? me? Uh -huh. For I can perceive that power has gone forth from me. Exactly. Yes, that, that, was, that was the act of faith. Because there was immediate withdrawal of power. Exactly. 
from the Son of God. But I thank you. <laughs> thank you very much. Uh, uh, faith mm. is the ultimate. That's uh, what brings the miracles in any boat. But faith in what? Faith in God. How does it come? It comes by hearing mm. and hearing mm. the word of God. So for faith to come, you should have it. Like the woman that we are talking about, he heard that Jesus is passing by. And he knew that Jesus is a healer. And then he said, how, how am I going to get my healing? She said, then he said, I will make my way, I will press in and touch the hem of his garment and I will be healed. So this is why I am now drawing everybody to the word of God because that's where faith comes from. Without the word, mm. you might have faith in every other thing, mm. but that's not faith in God. Faith in God comes through the word of God. Faith in a maker. Uh -huh. There was a star uh -huh. that fell all the way from the sky. Uh -huh. People continue to scrub it uh -huh. uh, using some clothes uh -huh. and they are going there. Uh -huh. They now say that's where God lies. Okay. People take idols in Greece. Uh -huh. They tell people to bring in monies. Uh -huh. At the back of the idol, someone uh -huh. is collecting the cash. Uh -huh. eh? after uh -huh. the church. Uh -huh. But they all say, we uh -huh. are praying to the Almighty, the creator of heavens and earth. Our mediator is the idol. Uh -huh. You say your mediator uh -huh. is Jesus, Jesus Christ. Christ. Uh -huh. There is the confusion. Uh -huh. What should people really know? They should know that uh, the Bible says that there is, there is one God and one mediator between God and men, uh -huh. the men. Jesus Christ. Any other thing mm. that tries to take his place, mm. that's idol worship. No matter you can get so much power mm. from whatever you are worshipping, but you are not worshipping God. Mm. Jesus Christ, like, a, like a, I said, he is the deliverer. Mm -hmm. He is the healer. Are you comfortable uh, one day meeting uh, a Muslim to, 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 to discuss issues of Christianity. Yes. But a Muslim coming down here uh -huh. to explain to you that Jesus is not the son of God. But he is just but one of the hundred prophets mm. uh, whom they do believe in. You know, you know what, what super makes... Who had natural powers. You know what makes Jesus Christ different? Mm -hmm. Is that uh, he died and rose from the dead. And uh, people saw him Mm. being lifted from the earth mm. into heaven. I, I wanted to, 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 to explain that healing, deliverance, they come from Jesus Christ. The Bible says, and, and I want to bring it maybe to the viewers so that they can, they can be, be clear on that. Mm -hmm. The Bible says about Jesus from John chapter number 1, you read from verse um, 12 uh, going forward. Let me just... Uh, there are a lot of things that are happening, uh, even as you have spoken, mm -hmm. how people are now being manipulated by so many things. And, uh, but I want to uh, uh, enlighten our nation, to enlighten everybody who might be watching, that uh, there is one God, and there is one mediator between God and men, the man Jesus Christ. This Jesus Christ, when you receive him, you receive him, mm -hmm. you get your healing, you get your deliverance, because the topic is healing and deliverance. Mm -hmm. But if you reject him, mm -hmm. you don't accept him in your heart, mm -hmm. then um, you may continue with uh, all those problems, all those oppressions of the devil. This is why the Bible says in a... In a, a John chapter number 1 from verse 12. The Bible says, but, he, but uh, let's, let's start from uh, uh, verse 11. Mm -hmm. He came to his own. He's talking about Jesus here. He came to his own and his own received him not. Mm -hmm. But as many as received him, to them gave he power to become the sons of God. Even to them that believe on his name. 
which were born not of blood, nor of the will of the flesh, nor of the will of men, but of God. Now I want to explain from there. Hmm. He says, yes. yes, and they did receive him. Right. But as many as received him, he gave the power to become the sons of God, which were not born of blood, which means when you receive Jesus Christ, mm. you are now a son of God, which is not born by blood, nor the will of men. You, you automatically change. Your spirit gets born again. So but that... No, Muti, Mimi. Do you wish to make the Lord God your eh, savior? Can yes. Him Baba did yes. Uh -huh. so, you, you, you automatically become a son of, of, of God. And then he says, which were not born of blood, nor the will of men. Eh, eh, why why is, he, is he separating the sons of God from the blood and the will of men? Mm -hmm. Because before Jesus Christ came, Men fell, you know, how the devil tricked or deceived Adam and he became the ruler over many and he began to oppress them and he began to destroy them. How did he do that? Mm -hmm. By bringing evil spirits into them because the devil is the chief evil spirit. So when uh, somebody is not born again and is not under Jesus Christ, mm -hmm. he will be under his kingdom. And if you are under his kingdom, he then seeks to manifest in your life through what he can give. He gives sickness. He gives demons. This is why you see people getting sick. You see people getting affected by evil spirits. Anything that disadvantages a man, anything that makes life not good, you look at yourself and say, my life is not pleasant. Maybe you are mature enough to get married. You have no husband. Mm -hmm. Why? Is it supposed to be so? It shows that something is oppressing you somewhere. Maybe you have got a, a physical problems, pains in your body. My headaches are singapore. My stomach problems are singapore. A lot of those attacks. And maybe you are educated. Mm -hmm. But you don't, you don't get a job. Even somebody who is not even educated to get that job and you don't even get it. Mm -hmm. And you are wondering, but what else? What could be hindering me mm -hmm. from getting the job? They said, go to school. I went to school. I have a degree. Mm -hmm. I'm qualified for this. Mm -hmm. But when I go there, they don't. Sometimes it happens because the devil will be trying to stop you. Because the Bible said that he does not come except to steal, to kill and to destroy. So if you find yourself in a state where you are not happy, you find yourself in a state where even what you deserve to have, it seems not to be coming to you. Mm -hmm. Somehow, you, there is something that is blocking you. That's the manifestation of the evil spirit. They manifest that way. Mm -hmm. They can make somebody to be barren. Mm -hmm. they, cannot, they can make somebody not to get married. Mm -hmm. They can make somebody to be poor mm -hmm. all their life. So that Every time you try, nothing. You are not even appreciated. This are not Munyama. You are not even appreciated. Mm -hmm. You do well to people. Mm -hmm. They don't respond by maybe doing uh, you a favor mm -hmm. back. Mm -hmm. That on its own, it shows that there is something mm -hmm. devilish that is covering your life. Mm -hmm. And what you need now is to, you need Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. When you come to Jesus Christ, you accept Jesus Christ as your Lord mm -hmm. and your Savior. Uh, translated that the scripture that I read in Colossians chapter number one mm -hmm. that he he, 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 he he delivers us from the kingdom of darkness into the kingdom of his dear son so when you see yourself like that things are not working you deserve this but you are blocked you try this it's not working what you need is Jesus Christ you are in a kingdom where they are oppressing you the devil is oppressing you. Mm -hmm. What you need is to be delivered from that kingdom mm -hmm. into the kingdom of God. And how do you do that? Mm -hmm. You accept Jesus Christ. When you accept Jesus Christ, the blood of Jesus automatically washes you. And then Jesus Christ gives you the power mm -hmm. over the devil. 
the processes of deliverance uh -huh. in terms of your church. Mm -hmm. We want to look at the chronological sequence of, of deliverance. All right, thank you. Uh, which I may, for example, mm -hmm. uh, pass through mm -hmm. when I come to your church. All right. Mm -hmm. When you come to our church, we preach the word of God. You have a problem. Mm -hmm. We preach the word of God because we believe that uh, true, genuine deliverance comes by knowledge. The Bible said that the Bible, God said that my people are destroyed for the lack of knowledge. So Satan is taking advantage of them because they lack knowledge. So when you come to our church, we teach the word of God. But there's someone right. who has got a PhD. All right. Is that the knowledge that he is required? They have the, that, 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 scientific, that scientific knowledge. And it is nothing before the devil. And what kind of knowledge in particular? You see, you need to... Yes. yes. We, give you, we give you the knowledge of God. We give you mm -hmm. how things look mm -hmm. before God. For example, Lazarus is dead and is buried mm -hmm. four days in the grave. Scientifically, they say he is dead. But when Jesus Christ came and they say, where have you laid him? He didn't say, where have you buried him? Because as far as Jesus Christ was concerned, he was not dead, but he was asleep. Mm -hmm. So you see, these are people who are operating with two different... Uh, 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 they are looking at uh, the same situation, but uh, from two different angles. They are seeing uh, using two different uh, uh, spectacles. Mm -hmm. And you see, mm -hmm. so... so uh, and, and when Jesus Christ went to the grave, he said, Lazarus, he didn't say, I raise you up. He said, rise up. Mm -hmm. come forth come forth mm -hmm. and he came forth so there is scientific knowledge which is very very important mm -hmm. it can help us to a certain level mm -hmm. but where it ends mm -hmm. divine knowledge starts there now mm -hmm. that's where you see somebody the phd mm -hmm. they they are a doctor but they have got a sickness mm -hmm. which they don't know what to do with it my mm -hmm. aramba says aramba mm -hmm. but when you come to divine knowledge mm -hmm. we just lay hands on you speak the word of God, mm. and it is done. Uh. It's very good for us to go to school, uh. get the education, uh. but uh, the, the, uh, the science knowledge mm -hmm. is nothing to the devil. Mm -hmm. The devil is above it. He is above the knowledge that we get from books. Mm -hmm. The only power that is above the devil mm -hmm. is the knowledge that comes from the word of God. This is why even Jesus Christ, when, he, when, when the devil came against him to tempt him, mm -hmm. Jesus Christ quoted the word. He knew that I don't have to use any other methods to defeat him. All that I need is to use the word of God. And when he used the word of God, mm -hmm. the devil flee. So you might be a PhD there mm -hmm. and you've got several problems. You're about to kill yourself. Things are not working. You are, you are, you, you, you have the, 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 the science knowledge, you have the knowledge, but you've got this problem, mm -hmm. which seem like your knowledge cannot mm -hmm. contain. Okay. What you need mm -hmm. is Jesus Christ, mm -hmm. the word of God, mm -hmm. which you can believe, mm -hmm. and the true man of God mm -hmm. who will teach you the word of God, mm -hmm. lay hands on you, mm -hmm. and deliver you from that problem.